here we are back with another concept breakdown from the world of Westfold. A complete fantasy world we are creating on this channel, full of characters, creatures, exciting locations, animation and concept art to visualize it all. Support the channel by subscribing and liking this video, this will help in the creation of future videos. Also let me know in the comments what locations or topics you would like to see next or if you have any questions about the process. As you will see using pre-made assets from the Epic Marketplace or Megascans makes it super quick to set up a scene to visualize an idea through concept art. You don't need to spend time on creating individual 3D assets, but you can use what is already there in different and creative ways. This means you can focus fully on the creative side. While you can go a long way in Unreal on its own, combining Unreal with a compositing or paint package such as Nuke or Photoshop speeds up the process and lets you fix issues quickly as well as add more interesting details in the image. Let's take a look at how the concept art for the entrance in the forest of the hollow trees were made. As always in Unreal, give yourself full control by turning off auto exposure in the view mode setting. Then turn the view mode to unlit while you build the scene, followed by deleting all elements that might be in the scene when you start. Here I started with this awesome Icelandic terrain asset from Quixel. It formed the base for my scene, and while most of it will be covered with other assets, it's a great way to start building on top of. After scouting for an ideal place to start building the scene, I set up a rough camera, so I have clear reference on where I'm working. In this case, the camera was set to a focal length of 24mm. Then I start to build the scene by adding large rocks and stones to create the cave entrance, followed by the mother tree in the middle and loads of other trees to give depth to the forest. I also add foreground trees to frame the shot. At this point I start to have a great base for the scene, so I turn the view mode to lit, so I can start to play with the distance fog as well as the lights. I wanted to have a natural, foggy and mysterious look to the scene, so I added a fair amount of fog using exponential height fog and a few lights with a soft fall off, so really softening the shadows. I also gave the other lights a bluish tint and the inner lights an orange tint to give a clear separation between the two. Now I will start to add details. The entrance looked clean so I added rocks on the ground and hanging roots from the cave ceiling. I also covered the opening with additional fallen tree trunks to hide straight CG lines. I added extra moss and roots to the forest floor and foreground sides just to soften these areas and give them a more natural look. Lastly, I added two stand-ins for where I wanted the main characters to appear. These would aid me when painting in the actual characters later. After rendering out the image from Unreal, it was time to fix a few things and add extra details in comp. I started with painting out on natural straight lines from the 3D objects. Then I added fog passes to break up the fog to make it look more sinister. I painted in extra shadows to enhance depth and added extra glows and highlights throughout the shot. Then it was time to work on the characters. I composited in various 2D elements such as armor, clothes, hair and weapons and made sure that they fit it into the lighting and environment. After a last pass of grading, the artwork was done and ready to be unleashed to the world. I hope you enjoyed this breakdown and please remember to like, subscribe and share so you will be the first to know when we post more artwork and stories on the channel. Stay safe out there and see you in the next video.